Alex Bimrose also struggled to adopt simply because she was white. Because of the, the belief amongst uh, and the guidelines that local authorities have, have long uh, kept to, they believe that children should be brought up in a home of uh, the same ethnicity as themselves. And they actually said the three biggest problems you're going to have is you're white, you're middle class and you're a heterosexual couple. So we looked at a number of different countries, um, ended up uh, going to Guatemala and approaching them with a view to adopting a child um, or sibling from there. And eventually we were able to adopt Jose. Um, we brought him home at 11 months. And yes, very, very lucky. <laughs> we so were very what's lucky. What's an expensive process? Of... It is a very expensive process. If you adopt overseas, then you have to cover the costs not only for the UK process, which you still have to go through. So you still have to go through all the, um, uh, the interviews, the, which is called the home study. Um, we had nine three-hour interviews with a social worker. Um, and then after that, you go to panel uh, where there was, a, I think it was 16, 14 or 16 um, panel judges sitting around a table and they look at the report that the social worker has drawn up and ask you various other questions. It's a terrifying process. Um, and then they will finally sort of confirm whether you're eligible or not, whether your pastor is eligible to adopt a child.